I have um, three pieces, and they're all from this uh, series uh, titled Infrastructure. And they're um, screen prints on Duralar, and um, the essence of what I'm trying to get to with that work is trying to distill um, moments of atrocity or devastation in a way of describing moments um, and how we perceive moments of devastation or atrocity in, um, through two-dimensional devices like a, an iPhone or a computer screen. And so um, it's taking images, actual found images, reappropriating them in a way that that compresses information and fractures information and um, breaks it apart, pixelates it, fractures it, and um, in a way to move beyond um, and trying to create a very cold feeling, a very sterile antiseptic feeling of um, uninvolvement or um, detachment from the actual um, situation that's happening. I want to come up with um, a beautifully blissful image um, that came about by um, hovering over something that was absolutely atrocious and devastating and, and painful and remove all that into this situation of bliss. And I think that it came about essentially through teaching, just the idea of um, how students receive information and how I deliver my curriculum, how I talk to students about work. And um, the, the big thing there for me was thinking about how they are perceiving information, how they're understanding information. As a painting instructor, it's really hard to give a PowerPoint projection and talk about color theory when the color's off on the projector and I'm trying to talk about complementary color scheme and it's not even what I'm thinking from the computer, uh, from the laptop computer image. So um, I guess I'm trying to address how we perceive visual information these days because it's not, it's not um, analog anymore. It's digital and it's compressed and it's so far removed from the actual thing, the actual moment that was captured. And um, I guess I'm trying to come up with an interesting way that visually represents that.